That you could only see the worst in me. I swear sometimes it feels like it meant to keep the door open. It's kinda hurting me. I could say I'm done with it, but it lurks in me. Hey, so I just found this little field. So I'm gonna just walk around and talk to y'all for a bit. Today and yesterday, I really just kind of like understood what I need to like get my energy right and everything and the answer is being by myself like <clears throat> being by myself and especially in the morning bro like when I wake up I remember when I was happy as hell right like when I was thriving and just my best self and healing and and just you know feeling good um it was when I would wake up and it was just me. Like, I wasn't going out as soon as I woke up. There was no one with me when I woke up, nothing like that. Um, it was just me. I would wake up, make my coffee if I wanted to get, make coffee. If I didn't want coffee, that was cool. Um, I would bump music to wake up. Cause I'm not, I'm not a morning person per se, but when I don't have to speak to anyone and I can just be by myself, but I'm a morning person cause I don't gotta talk to no one. It's just me and my own energy, right? And yeah, I kind of forgot about that high key, like how important it is for me to have solitude when I wake up um, and also my nighttime routines, like, cause those are the most important, like that's what sets you up for the day. You know what I'm saying? Your nighttime routine sets you up for the morning. If you go to sleep late and you just all rambled and all shit, your morning can't be that great. And then same thing with the morning. If my morning is late and I'm fucked up, my night ain't gonna be that great. And boom, it's a cycle of fucked up days. So. Yeah, I've just been really paying attention to that. And, uh, you know, that was essentially the missing piece. Cause for a while here, I've just been like really lost. I'm not gonna lie. Just trying to find like my groove. Cause I used to have a groove um, and I kind of lost it, but I'm kind of just kind of finding, basically finding out everything I used to do and just new things that I can implement to be a better me and actually create sustainable habits that are positive to me and my mental my physical and everything like that um stuff like being out in nature i forgot about doing so that's why i'm out here right now uh hiking just by myself just you know a little music playing just quiet um some alone time and uh, yeah i find myself way more sociable and fun and interactive when i do have these moments of solitude right because then I'm actually charged, prepared, and in the right mental space to go out and then socialize and express myself in the best way. You know what I'm saying? And put my best foot forward. So to build myself back up uh, to the person that I know I can be, it's not that easy, bro. Like, you know, you don't just wake up, all of a sudden, boom, you have routines. It takes like day by day and fixing the things that you notice that you could be doing better. Like, you know, and being real with yourself. Like me, nigga, I'll stay up till, you know, one in the morning, two in the morning, three in the morning, and I had to call myself out on that shit. Like, bro, what the fuck are you up doing? When you could go to sleep, wake up, and then, you know, complete all the tasks that you have for the day and still have free time. That's essential because now, bro, like, I'm gonna be transparent with y'all on some of the shit I struggle with. So, like, bro, I'd wake up, right? Let's say I wake, so when I wake up at like 12 p.m., right? Because I had a fucked up night. When I say fucked up, I don't even mean like getting fucked up. I mean fucked up as in you staying up watching YouTube videos and like eating fucking ice cream. Um, that essentially fucks me up and just keeps me in the loop of fucked upness, right? Because boom, I wake up at 12 p.m., right? And then how am I supposed to, you know, have time for my social life, my friends, my family, uh, anything like that, right? Because I wake up at 12, I haven't even eaten yet. I probably haven't done any chores in the house. I haven't had time to just sit and be still. Uh, that's why when I wake up, I'm always on go and it shouldn't be like that, but it's because I wake up so late that I don't have enough time to just do things at my own pace. You know, if I woke up at 7 a.m., 8 a.m., you know, I could wake up, chill. I ain't gotta do shit. Kick with my pets, kick with my family. You know, go, go do something, maybe go on a hike, come back, still have time to chill. Uh, you know, learn something new, uh, partake in some of my crafts, you know, anything like that. But me waking up late just puts me at such a bad place to to be my best self like i am be real i have a lot of things that like i want to do in life and i'm pretty sure y'all do too because we're all humans and we all have gifts and talents so for me i'm disrespecting myself ultimately giving myself half the day to do everything i need to do i can't thrive in a limited space you feel me like 
I, I can't. And it's not even like this is like a, oh, you know, it's cool. If, you know, say one day out of the month, I woke up at 12 p.m. and I didn't have that much time to do things. That's fine. But when I wake up every single day late, that doesn't that doesn't make the ratio is just fucked up. And then I only have one good day of me waking up. That's not it. But yeah, yo, if y'all are struggling, like I would just really suggest just check where your time is going to like sleeping in and all that shit, man. Like it feels comfortable, but if we want to grow, we got to get all fucking comfortable. Like that's what I realized. That's why I took myself out. I went, I said, hey, you know, you're going to go on this fucking hike. Yesterday I went on a run. I said, you're going to go on this fucking run, my guy, because the shit that's uncomfortable makes you stronger. And that's what's going to build you. You can't just sit in the comfort of your own fucking home, not doing shit. Like it hasn't got me where I want to be. So why the fuck am I going to keep doing it? You feel me? Like I just got to stop bullshitting myself. Like, shit be hard. It's not even that hard when you get up and do it. But yeah, yo. Uh, this is basically like a little motivational talk. I hope it motivated y'all in the slightest. Because sometimes we need motivation, bro. But yeah, yo. Go out and get your fucking life. Like, for real, for real. If you want that shit, you gotta go and get it. It seems really daunting, but ain't nothing daunting like that, bro. Like, we, everybody on this earth is capable of whatever the fuck they want to do. So, just fucking go after it. Like, if you want to fucking be a YouTuber, make a video today. If you want to be a fucking artist... Do something musically today, you know? Like, it's a step, bro. You wanna make a song? Write some fucking lyrics down and then you can go back to them and fix them and all that. Just make sure that every day you wake up, though, you're doing something to, like, better yourself. Like, today, I woke up and I, I'm out here. Today, I woke up, I'm about to go get a charger because my fucking charger broke. I think my dog ate it. Yeah. Anyways, I'm about to go get a fucking charger so I can go home and edit, work on music, whatever I wanna do, just build myself. So yeah, I encourage y'all to do the same because we got this shit. Like our minds are fucking assholes, bro. Our minds will tell us, now nah, you good, stay comfortable. Now nah, you good, stay doing the same shit. Fuck that, bro. If you want to stay in the same position, do the same shit. If you want to actually boss up and be a different person, you gotta do that uncomfortable shit. But yeah, yo. <sighs> All right, I'm gonna cut it off here because the lighting is terrible. But um, I lied on the Texas video because I was sick as fuck and my sister had life. Okay, but it's coming. Um, y'all will see that soon. But for now, just enjoy this motivational video. I really hope it helps y'all because, man, fuck this shit. Like, fuck this shit. Fuck all our doubts in our head. Fuck all that shit. Like, we got this shit. I know everybody got something. I ain't even in. And I say this and I mean it when I say, like, I want y'all to thrive because, like, I ain't in competition with nobody but myself. Like, everyone has their own thing. Like, we could both be artists and still pop. We could both be YouTubers and pop. It's not a competition. You ain't got to... If I make it, it, doesn't mean you ain't gonna make it. And if you make it, it doesn't mean I'm not gonna make it. And I had to also adopt that mindset because I used to be a fucking hater. All right? Don't be a fucking hater. Be a fucking motivator, bitch.